Hello everyone and welcome to my demo for Speedy Apply. Speedy Apply is a Chrome extension tool that streamlines the job application process. With this tool, you can quickly apply to jobs, track completed job applications, and customize the tool to meet your needs. In this demo, I will walk you through setting up the extension and show you how Speedy Apply can improve your job hunting experience. So let's start by adding the extension to our browser. When you first install Speedy Apply, you're met with the extensions pop-up. Here you can see how many jobs you've applied to each day, and also quickly access different parts of the extension, such as the analytics page, managing your profile, and managing your settings. From the pop-up, you can also quickly toggle the extension's autofill. Now let's take a look at the analytics page. Here you can track every company and job you've applied to while visualizing your progress over time. So to use the autofill extension, we need to create our application profile. So let's do that. When creating your profile, be sure to include all the information you would normally include when applying for a job. If you already have a profile from previously using the extension, you can import one here. I'm going to do that so I don't bore you with filling out my details. After creating your profile, you are met with the profile page. The profile page is similar to your resume, where you can view and edit different aspects about yourself so you can be ready to apply for jobs. Now that my profile is ready to go, let's take a look at the settings page and see how we can customize our job application experience. Now there are a lot of options that you can toggle, but most of them are specific to your job application portal. You can still change some general settings such as saving your completed applications. For each job portal, you can toggle the extensions autofill. Maybe for some extensions, say, such as Greenhouse, you don't like how the autofill works or you want to do it on your own, so you can disable it if you'd like. You can also enable the extension to automatically submit job applications for you. You might want to do this in instances where you need to speed through applications. Another option that you can use is setting your account password. For job portals such as Workday, you have to create a new account for every company that you apply to. This can be quite tedious and repetitive. After setting your account password, the extension will automatically apply your password to forms where you have to log in or create an account. Now I must say that this is not really a secure practice because you should not be reusing the same password for different websites, but this is a good option if you are trying to speed through applications. I'm going to set my account password so I can show you what it looks like when applying to jobs. Now that we've looked at all the different settings options, Let's actually apply to some jobs using Speedy Apply. The first job we are going to apply to is on Workday. This job looks good, so let's apply. When applying to a job on Workday, you can select any option, so I'll go ahead and click Apply Manually. And here we're met with a login form, and as I mentioned, the account password is already set with an email. I don't have an account, so let's create one. And as you can see here, the account password is also set with its email. Let's create my account and start the application. As you can see, Speedy Apply has already filled out the first page of the form. As you can see, the extension has correctly added my personal information to the application. Let's click Save and Continue to move on with the application. When I click Save and Continue, I get this error that I didn't answer one of the questions. For questions like these, you have to answer manually, but let's move on to the Experience page. Here the extension adds all of my information a lot faster than I would have on my own. This is where the power of Speedy Apply becomes apparent. It added my work experience, my education experience, my languages. It also added my resume and also my personal websites. Before we move on with the application, I'm going to change some of the workday settings in the extension to show you how they work in action. Let's enable automatically clicking the next page and automatically submitting the application. So let's go back to the application and refresh the page. Now we can see the extension automatically filling out the form and clicking save and continue when it's done with each page. Here we're stopped at the application questions page because most questions you will have to answer manually. But some questions such as your sponsorship status will be answered automatically. I'll go ahead and fill out these questions on my own. When I click save and continue, we're going to see the extension move on and fill out the voluntary disclosures 
in self identity pages. After that, it will automatically submit the job application. So let's go back to the extension and look at our analytics page. Here we can see the job we just applied to. We can see the job link and company link so we can go back for future reference. So that was how the extension worked with Workday. Let's check out a simpler application form such as Greenhouse. Just after opening the link, the extension has already filled out the entire application. As you can see, Speedy Apply is a great tool to add to your job application toolbox. Let's go back down to the application to see what it did. So it added my personal information, it added my resume, my websites, and the extension also filled out the equal employment information. Before I submit the application, let's go back to the settings and change the option for Greenhouse to automatically submit. Let's go back and refresh the page. As you can see, the application didn't submit because a couple questions weren't answered. These types of questions you will have to answer on your own. Personally, I like leaving auto submit enabled so I get these error messages so I can quickly find the questions that I need to answer versus looking through the application on my own. So let's apply to the job and go back to our analytics page. And here we can see the job we just applied to. We can go back to the job link for future reference. And I believe that's it. So that concludes my demo for Speedy Apply. Thank you for trying out Speedy Apply and I hope it improves your job hunting experience. I'm open to feedback and suggestions, so feel free to reach out to me. Have a great day.